Hello guys, Birmingham Talk TV here. So yes, it's a new name, new channel name. Today I'm going to be doing my match preview for Birmingham, no, Bristol City versus Birmingham City because we're away. Um, so yeah, last season we we beat uh, we beat Bristol. Was it three one? Yeah, three one away with a beautiful Drewbridge goal. I think it was a Wiseman own goal. And yeah, a Scott Hogan tap in, wasn't it? And then the only reason they scored was because Mark Roberts made the mistake. He passed it back to Lee Camp. He didn't put enough weight on it. Lee Camp couldn't get it, obviously. And yeah, we conceded. So that's how it went. Um, yeah, away, away day at Bristol. I think it's going to be a hard game, especially in our current form. And then I think he's just going to play the same boring, 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 boring lineup he always plays. He'll probably play three at the back again with the wing backs, when he really lets Benis play. Like Pedersen left wing back, Colin right wing back. Three centre backs are probably play Harley Dean, George Friend, and or Roberts and Clark Salter. And the three in the field are probably by Sanchez, San Jose and Sunic, and then the two at front, Hogan or Djukovic or Leko Djukovic, and either strike partnerships we have. But yeah, I think I think he'll do that because he has done that the last two games in a row. But we need we need a win or a draw. No, I wouldn't even well. We need a win or a draw. We can't come on. We can't lose. We need. We need to definitely go for that win because look, look, we've literally got three wins out of thirty-three matches. Do you know how bad that is? I mean, for all the Cranker in fans, you're saying that oh, it's the project. It's the project. It's a project with Cranker Rome, but wasn't built overnight. But yeah, I mean, we should definitely be improving, shouldn't we? But we've improved in defensive, but. That doesn't mean we have to we have to park the bus all game like Grant does. He literally just parks the bus. I think he has his only intention of scoring is like set pieces, but even on set pieces on corners, we we do the short corners which don't make sense because say if say if uh, Sanchez is taking the corner and Bella comes short or Bella could be in the box, couldn't he? That could be another man in the box, but instead they play it short, then cross it in. Like what's the point? You just directly cross it in, especially when we're the best. One of the best teams at set pieces in the league. We've got a lot of height in our squad, but I don't know why we don't do it. Also, Halovic is cleared for inter is It has been cleared, sorry. So he could make an appearance. A doubt to make an appearance. I think he'll. St I think he'll come on the bench. I think he'll start on the bench. Possibly come on later on in the game if Cranker does make substitutions, but she probably won't. Let's be honest. And yeah, my score predictions. My score prediction is actually going to be two 0 Bristol. I think I don't think we'll even, I don't think we'll even score. Uh, Bristol, you know, good team, good team. So, yeah, we'll see. But I'm dreading paying ten pounds. It's going to be another nil nil or something like that. Like, at least be a, at least be a couple of goals in the game. Like the boring, boring games we've seen previously. So yeah, that's been Birmingham Talk TV. Uh, that's been my preview and I'll see you in the next video which will be my review on Saturday so yeah keep right on